So you're jumping into Persona 5 Royal for the first time on PlayStation, Xbox, or Nintendo Switch, or you've already been playing Persona 5 Royal on one of those platforms and you're finally just wondering, how the heck do I increase these social stats and max them out? You might be stuck or you might just wanna get these social stats up, up, and away very quickly. That way you don't have to worry about them any longer and you can unlock some of the goodies that comes along with it. What's going on? I am Dom from The Game Looters, and in this video, I'm gonna help you increase your charm and become charming in Persona 5 Royal. So without further ado, let's get into how to increase charm, social stat, and Persona 5 Royal. So the first way to increase your charm in Persona 5 Royal is one that you can access very early on. And this is by using the bathhouse. You are going to need to head to the bathhouse near your home at LeBlanc in Yongin Jaya. And when you do, this is going to increase your charm and debonair status. You'll also get bonus points if it happens to be raining or if you go to the bathhouse on Mondays or Thursdays. So when you're ready to take a quick dip, make sure you head to the bathhouse during those days. The second way that you can increase your charm is by going to the lovely, lovely Maid Cafe. Yes, that's right. Once the Maid Cafe becomes available, head to the Ma Maid Cafe to increase your charm. You're gonna be able to do this without a bonus boost, but it is going to offer points for other stats at the same time. So what I mean by that is you're gonna be able to increase your charm along with other social stats by simply just going and having a good time at the Maid Cafe. I mean, who doesn't like Maid Cafes, right? The third way that you can increase your charm is by interacting with confidants. These are gonna be the Sun and Devil Arcana confidants. Those two confidants are going to be Oya, the reporter. She has the Devil Arcana. And the second one is going to be our favorite politician, Yoshida. He is going to be the Sun confidant. So when you interact with both of these confidants, they are going to increase your charm stat when you hang out with them. Both of these are going to give you a flat rate, or I should say like a flat increase to your charm every time that you hang out with them. So if they are available to hang out with, go ahead and uh, take, a, take a walk, take a gander, or help our favorite politician make sure that he gets elected. The fourth way that you can increase charm is this one's again available very early on. And that's simply by reading charming books. Once you're able to check out or purchase some of the books that will increase your charm, do it. Some of the books that are gonna help you are gonna be playing the game, Reckless Casanova and Alluring Dancer. This leads me into number five. This is also available very early on. Make sure that you are watching TV and playing video games. We're already doing that, so might as well do it a little bit more. Now, the retro game console is gonna be available from our lovely neighbor in Yongin Jaya a little later on. So once it becomes available, go ahead and purchase that. Some of the things on TV, or I should say DVDs that you can purchase from the DVD shop are gonna be the Bubbly Hills 90210 and Not So Hot Betsy. Now, when you watch these, it's going to increase your charm. The games that will increase your charm are Gombla Goman and Punch-Out. These are going to increase your charm as well. So once you can get them, make sure that you play and watch them. The sixth way to increase your charm is by visiting the movie theater. So once the movie theater becomes available, go ahead and go check out some movies to increase your charm. Some of the ones that are going to do this for you is in January, you're gonna be able to watch The Fighting Friends. And in September, you're gonna be able to watch Like a Showtime Tiger. These both will increase your charm. And the last way to increase your charm is by doing amazing on your exams. So make sure that you have a high knowledge stat and make sure that you are using the network to answer questions during your exam. So make sure that you are able to increase your knowledge and your proficiency because if a teacher also throws a chalk at you, you'll increase your charm as well. 
But when it comes to exam time, go ahead and ace those exams. It's not cheating, you're just using a function in the game by using your network, like friends, like me, to help you out. So my friends, those are how to become a debonair and increase your charm. If this helped you out, make sure you throw us a like and of course subscribe and check out the other videos on screen now to increase your other social stats. We'll see you in the next one.